Hello and welcome back to Slice and Dice. Greens or defensive? Hell no, I'm never playing defensive. Fuck that comp. Um, Primrose is a very good character. Tinder's great. Buckler is... Buckler's okay. Scout, Scoundrel is terrible. Oh god, Scoundrel lazy. Oh, this is, this is looking like a reroll. Unless we get some crazy setup here. Cyclops, I think it's fine, but I don't know if it's that good in green. At least it doesn't impact the early game, so I would say... Wait, middle HP is... Uh, is it rounded up or down? I forget. I think it's the 8th HP? Or is it 7th? I don't remember. I, I guess I can check. I can just check. No, I can't. Okay, never mind. Thought it would show me the... Uh, permadeath, one kill, highest, fewer rerolls, flighty, add bore, worse items. This is, uh, yeah, this is not good. This is not good. Unless I want to take add Cyclops, which, again, I think is doable. It is extremely dependent on whatever greens I find in the mid game, though. Because that could easily kill me. It is by no means easy to deal a damage, especially on the... Um, in potential fights with ghosts and stuff, if you take a three AOE, you're just dead. I'm not gonna do it. I think it's uh, greens not great defensively and not great offensively. I think they're a little bit too middle of the road. Okay. Hell no, I'm not taking RNG. All right, I think it's it's finally gonna be a basic. I'm forced into it here. Point two, point two. By the way. <laughs> All right. Thief good, ruffian. Fine. Alloy is fine. Splint is good. Fucking meddler. Okay, well. Gadgrave is pretty easy. Actually, no, for f eh. for four. I was going to say, I thought this was more, but. That is not a five. Are you kidding me? That is like a three. <laughs> Something like that. That is trash. Terrible. Never take that. Odd blank, okay. Rightmost Caltrops is a buff to Meddler, so <laughs> I'll take it. And then we'll just take a four, I think. Better items too is 100% not worth it. I think worse items definitely takeable. I've taken it before in basic. It's probably fine, but if I can dodge it, I would prefer that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go bot blank caltrops here. Bot blank doesn't affect the early game that much. And caltrops helps me a little bit. And then we'll just take grave since we have a uh, basic team comp. We have um, potential good orange that can deal with the grave. Hopefully, otherwise we're in trouble, but yeah. Oh, let's get it. Back to basics. And fuck you. What the? Goodness. My goodness. That is not. That is not good. Can't even slay that. Might as well slay that then. I'll probably kill the boar here. Unless I get boned. Please, meddler. Please. What? Wait, who was at 1 HP? I didn't even pay attention. Wait, somebody was at 1 there? Oh shit, I might lose, actually. Okay, I didn't lose. Oh. Whoa, whoa. I, I did not keep track of who was at what there. That's my bad. Ruffian was at 1? I'm playing a little bit too fast. It's been... I, I'm on my third run today, so... <laughs> Yeah, sorry if I'm a little bit less focused, but I have to grind. Otherwise, you guys are getting no content. Oof. I need to level up my low HP heroes, which is to say all of them, honestly. And I need to level up Meddler because Meddler is Meddler. Druid isn't the worst. 
But Splint is one of my better characters here. This bandage is really good. Balance is okay, but it's better in a triple magic. Sinew is absolute ass cheeks. Uh, eh. Actually, it's okay, but... I don't know. I don't value it too much. Um, I don't like the sustain power of Druid. I'm gonna random here. Love Priestess. Okay. Love Priestess. Do not bone me, please. Do I even roll this? Like, <laughs> that's a good, that's a very good question. Hmm. This guy can't roll this because I gotta I gotta get Ruffian at a higher HP total. Wow, great. No. No. One on Meddler. I do have to spend some mana though. So I guess I'll just kill the bee. Can you not just petrify this immediately, please? Five? Oh, is that a two? Yes, sir. How do I do this? I this is going in here, which means I need to shield. I think this is rolling then. All right, so you, 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 then, then, copper ring, big shield. I think Copper Ring's pretty good. The reserve mana can be really clutch. Big Shield also pretty good. I would value both about the same. Big Shield is a side replacer for Roulette in case we want a random, so that's also got some value there. In terms of late game, Copper Ring's obviously the most useful, I would say. I think we're looking more towards late game because of the add grave, so let's go for copper ring. Damn it, I was hoping it would replace my meddler, but nope. Please don't bone me. Okay, didn't, not boned, not boned. Successfully not boned. Two on this. One. You need to shield yourself, you need to heal yourself. You need to kill this. Cleave Ruffian, please. Hello, guys? Can you not do that? Wake up. Wake up. Man, this is tough. Probably Ninja. Berserker is probably just never a pick, right? Bottom is very important for Berserker. Probably looking for like Brute, Soldier. Col uh, Collector is missing a good side. I guess we're. Ah, uh, this is tough. Ninja. is probably one of the better characters, because at least uh, the copycat is better with the cantrip stuff well better or worse depending on the fight also it would have mana gain it would have cleave potential it would have range it would have boned which is amazing god it, oh my god if i get cantrip boned i'm gonna lose my shit <laughs> i'm gonna actually lose it i'm gonna lose my mind copycat cleave I think it's fine. It has a dodge too. It's it's reasonable. It's actually pretty good at dealing with the graves, which is kind of a number one uh, priority for me to find a character that's good against graves, and I think that would be part of that. 
Can I support this 5 damage hit? The answer is probably yes. That's so close. That is so close. Uh, yeah. Good luck, guys. Have fun. Hold your breath. Okay, we're good. Safe. I'm not rolling that. Hell no. Come on, ninja. Oof. Ninja is not happy. Very angry. Something's not right here. Something ain't right. Maybe this? It's still at one, right? Safety over anything. Probably. Come on, guys. You got this? Yep. I love Meddler's spell. When Meddler's good, it is so good. Plus one to non-damage. Garnet. Garnet's generally very solid. Yeah. I'm always happy with that. The blind. Oh, wow. This turn is interesting. Is it worth wasting, quote unquote, wasting? Wait. Wait. Five, nine. So it doesn't, the vitality doesn't. Yeah, okay. Just curious. I think I've tested that before. Might be worth letting it flee, but I'm kind of wasting the double damage hit here. That's probably not worth it. If I roll this, I just take out a pseudo. Wait, I should lock this. Actually, I'm so scared that's gonna roll bone and then screw me over. Don't bone me, bro. Meddler, no, don't meddle. Oh, goodness. Ooh. <laughs> Ew. Is that not the worst pilgrim you've ever seen in your life? Holy shit. Okay, Scrapper is not that bad if Ninja can soften the blow on... Or not soften the blow, soften uh, enemies up. Still not my number one priority. I think every other character is better. Yep. Except for Gladiator, I would say. The same can be said for Pilgrim, where I think every character is better, right? Except for Cleric. Oh, I can't- oh, I can get Cleric. Uh, okay, Bard is not great. Monk is not great. Knight is not great. Armor is terrible. Guardian is not great. Okay, everybody's not great. Warden's probably the best. So is this better than most characters? The answer might be yes, because it's kind of hard to get a character that has four sides to begin with. It still has access to stun. I think it's actually not bad. But I really want to replace this guy, but... Still... Repeat's kind of cool. Undying's kind of cool. Self-shield's kind of good. Yeah, it's actually not that bad. It just looks bad because you want Pilgrim with all sides, but it is good. It does upgrade the max HP of my team by a lot as well. So I'm just so sad that Meddler is not getting a replacement anytime soon. Repeat three. Okay, never mind. I'm not sad. I'm very happy. Wow. Beautiful.
Get out. It just, it just hurts in my... Yeah, it hurts my soul to not see double stun. Very difficult to cope with that. But, man, it is cooking right now. This is amazing for Pilgrim. And Smelling Manure is not playable, so... Yeah, we found a good combo already. That is very, 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 very strong. Although, one stun, which is unfortunate, but could be a little bit better. Do I roll this? Uh, probably... Ugh, probably, yeah, I can't leave a character out one, right? I probably have to lock that. I mean, I do have to damage Slate at some point, so maybe it's just not worth it. I don't want to get boned, but I feel like I have to roll. I Maybe I roll, because I, I can hit dodge. I, I don't think... I think it's too risky. Ooh, let's go. Great. Wow. Meddler just decided to wake up. Dude, Meddler's good. It's such a good character. Oh, hell no. Not always cooking. <laughs> when it cooks, it cooks, but the same can be said for when it doesn't cook. I gotta get rid of this guy, please. The bone copycat is so bad. It's so bad. It's unplayable. Evoker. Hmm. Man, Evoker is not really a good character, but... Bot blank. I think most other blues are actually better than Evoker. Better. Better. Questionable. Probably better. Yeah, better. Questionable. Better. Questionable. Gladiators, okay. I mean, the thing is, I have to replace Metalers. There's no consideration for Gladiator just because it, I can just lose the game on a boned cantrip, so. Maybe it is Evoker. Ah, it's not good, but it's. It is replacing my meddler, which is good. I mean, technically it has like similar sides to meddler, like this is similar and it's not losing anything. I think it's fine actually. It has eight, eight power, uh, eight, I wanna say toughness cause magic, but no, eight um, HP. Oh, you are not moving slam. If, if Pilgrim decides to not let you move, you are not moving with that amount of HP. Good. I mean, I guess I lock that to kill Slimeline, just in case. So top bottom is the most vulnerable position here to, to protect. I mean, I got him. No, actually, I can I can roll. I can keep that. Keep. Oh no. Am I going straight for Slime Queen? I think so. I can drop it, maybe. I have Ochre Breaking is bad. Really bad. Good. Fine. I mean, I'm looking for a repeat or stun. One mana is better than nothing. I think it's dead, actually. That's good. <laughs> uh, classic. I should have maybe kept the um, self shield. It's not like super relevant, but I 
5 damage plus 2. 1 dead. You can roll this. Done. 5, 2. The Caltrops is really scary here. Got to be kidding me. Of course, that's going on Invoker. Oh, man. Why is it going on Invoker? That's so bad. I need mana, but I can't. Can't roll it. Oh! Bless your soul, ninja. Bless your soul. That's <laughs> so good. I'm just getting so lucky. Remove all keywords from left side. Okay, that is good for Ruffian, but that's really about it. I think I'd rather have the extra HP. Good on Priestess. What else does Eye Patch do? So Eye Patch is good with Roulette, right? Yeah, really good with Roulette. Anything else? Oh, really good with Bash as well. Okay, there's some potential here. Oh, really good with Garbage. Oh, wait, wait. This is a better item than I expected. Wait, I might take that. That's That opens up two of the strongest characters in each... Well, three, like this as well. Three characters that are extremely strong. And I think that's it, right? Yeah, that's it. Oh, gas as well. Okay, that's very interesting. I do think this is a better item, but... Actually, no, I, I don't know. I feel like, yeah, on average, the other one's a better item, but the height of this item is just... Uh, yeah, the, the peak power level is way higher. And since we have a ruffian that can use it immediately, I think it's worth it. Wow. <laughs> it, was, it was very happy that I took that item. <laughs> that's funny. Okay. Help. Help. Send help. I need help. Wow. Okay, Ruffian is having a great time. <laughs> he is extremely happy. Nice dodge, by the way. Goodbye. Soldier and Collector. Hmm. Probably Soldier. It's so random. It's freaking Whirl guaranteed. Oh no, Whirl or Brute. That is interesting. I feel like both are kind of better than these. So Brute, Self Shield's nice. Soldier highest highest average damage output. Don't really need the stun per se. Also, the self damage would be better with um so with ninja collector is way better. I think it's collector actually. It's kind of lower DPS, but also way better with ninja. I think that's a that's more of a consideration than anything. I mean, I should roll, right? I need the cleave. Or the double, please. Okay. Who's weak? Bolt? Wow. Oh, goodbye, Collector. <laughs> goodbye. You are useless on this turn, but also you're not taking damage, which is nice. Double? Nice. One on orange, one on red. Uh-oh. Goodness. Oof. 
Maybe it's better to kill Quartz. Stun Ghost. Because Quartz weakens, which is really annoying. Don't really want to deal with that. And my damage output is zero. <laughs> Actual zero at this point. Well, scepter not great. Purity, purity is um ah purity is good but bad at the same time because it's only one side. But cleanse is worth a lot. It is. It is worth a lot. Scepter copy not great. I think. Pooh. Okay, purity. So it'd be mostly. The stalwart would be fantastic. I mean, it's okay on every—it's okay on everybody. I think it's just like not, yeah, except for these two. But that's a classic. It's okay here. Like it's always good. I think it's better to have a cleanse than to not have a cleanse. So, fuck. That—that that hurts me though. That hurts my soul. That hurts my soul. But again, cleanse is like one of the most valuable keywords in the entire game. So, I'm not going to pass up on it. I just rolled a stun, okay. I did not just roll a stun. It's back. Never rolled. Okay. We have a problem. Curator is dying. Well, I guess I won't be dying if I stun that, but then Grave is summoning? Well, I guess it's not summoning if I do this. I kind of have to deal with the grave. I've already lost a few times to grave, so I'm not going to risk it. Wow, how happy am I that it's going on Pilgrim? <laughs> That's amazing. Okay. Great. Oh, not great. But I have this, so I think we're fine. I can't really afford to keep that because it's not actually a good side. I think that's acceptable. Pilgrim is so tanky. Man, I love Pilgrim. When it, ah, gee, imagine it had all its sides. Creator is very, very strong. But also it's missing two of its best sides. Oh, not, not like two of its best sides, but like two really good sides. Shaman is Fine. Yeah, Shaman's fine, but I don't know about Curator. I feel like it's not looking like a good character here. Oh, or like or like it's fine, but man. It's one of the rare characters in And I have the remove keyword, so I should probably not take it. I should probably not take this. Because I have very high value in like a few other characters that are just probably better. I think this side's good. I think this side's good. I mean, to be fair, all the sides are good, except for charge, probably. But it's not bad either. And this side has potential if I find a, the right shielding character. So Curator is a good pick. It's probably better than randoming, but it's not better than finding one of those broken synergy characters that I could, that I could pick up. But it's also very mediocre with Pilgrim because you can't shield. So until then, this is a one damage side for the most part. This is like one or two or three maximum. This is good, as always. And then this is obviously good as well. It's just gotta be Curator. It's too, I think it's too strong to not take. It's also very decent with Ninja. Okay, I kinda I have to remove the <laughs> I have to remove the keyword there. That is very scary that it's hitting Ninja here, but I can lock. I have three sides that are useless. It's just the cantripping that could be a problem. Wow, Priestess dying immediately? Whoa. Did I roll this? I think so. I forgot, I can't... Well, I didn't want to keep this, but...
I mean, I cleansed it, so... Probably best case. It's gonna be a weird fight, for the most part. Let's see. Probably gotta lock this. Probably gonna have to roll this. Oh shit, I, for I, totally, I totally forgot about that. That's my bad. I guess I just gotta lock it. Wow, this is, uh, this is a very scary situation. I think I fucked up somewhere. Well, rolling the ninja was a big mistake. Okay, that's ninja. Lock. Repeat. Repeat has potential, but it really depends. I think it's better than most of the sides. Kind of have... I can't really... <laughs> can't do much here. I think I have to... This is a really bad situation, actually. I think I have to roll this. Oof, okay. Got lucky. Oh, I got really lucky. Um, I think I just... I gotta try to brute force through this. It's gonna be tough. If creator dies, I think I lose. Fuck! Okay, um... I honestly think I might die unless I make it flee, which is a possibility, I guess. It's my only out at this point. It's not good. Okay, I can stun it. That is good. I'm trying to roll a blank, but whatever, it's fine. It's so close to fleeing, I feel like. Will it flee if I just sacrifice Ninja here? And I just heal twice for... I think it will. I need 20, right? This is 10. 4. No, it's 12. Okay, I think it's it flees. I can't, I can't do it. I just can't kill it. <laughs> I actually can't kill it. I wish I rolled a dodge, but didn't. Yeah, that was so tough. I have no damage without Ninja. That's really unfortunate that I had to take advantage of that. Mana gain to all sides with exactly one thing. That's pretty helpful. I do need the mana, so... What does that open up for me? It opens up... It opens up Dancer, somewhat. Worst case, it just goes on Curator, which would be fine-ish, because I could do this. But all I know is I need the mana gain right now. Wrench is cool, but I, can I cannot add that. Alright, mana gain to Copycat, that's okay. For now, it might cantrip into that. This is a very scary fight, I, I could easily lose here. It's all on Curator. He has to hit the 6. Yeah, that's not good. That's not a good start. Okay, hit the 6. Okay, this is... Okay, that, this might work. Wait, it's not repeat on that. It's, uh... Repeat on this. Oh shit. Oh, it's dead. Oh no. Wait. Hold up. Can I. Wait, wait, wait. I feel like there's an out somewhere. Oh, this is really bad. This is very unfortunate. I needed one mana. Did I did I roll past one mana? I think I did. I think I might just have to accept that ninja's done. 
I can still do it. It's really hard with Chomp, but... I need Pilgrim to take some damage for me, that's all I know. Evoker has to stop screwing me over, though. Okay, that's fine. Self-Shield's very helpful here. And then, unfortunately, I don't think that's enough. I guess I have to self-shield. So I could roll this, but if it bricks, I can't save Evoker. I think it's better to save Evoker here. I think it's <laughs> so tough. It's so hard. Stun is big. That cleave is a little bit too much. I need help here. I need. I need help. Okay, I got the help. Got that. It's better than most of my other sides, anyways. Okay. Okay, so. Ray, wait, Ray, then stun. Priestess is at two, or I could just stun. Could pray, then stun this. Heal here. No, I, I don't know. I don't know. No, that's not it. It's gotta be stun alpha. Wait, no, it's gotta be stun chomp. It's more da it's more damage. I don't care about the damage on pilgrim, so that's the thing. I'm just gonna do this, I guess. I, I can't let this caltrops kill me. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay. Opportunity. Big opportunity. Okay. Okay, somewhat stable. Somewhat stable. Now I just gotta make sure I don't get screwed by Caltrops too much, and then we're okay. I'm not even gonna risk rolling Evoker there. Oh my god, I almost died. The problem is, how the hell am I ever going to... ...tank the damage from this? This is six, right? I can kill it right now if I want to. At the cost of Evoker. I think it's wrong. But then in, in that case, I don't have much counterplay except for this. Buys me a little bit of time. Okay, yeah, this helps. This helps. This uh, this is fine. If Curator rolls any damage, okay, I think we're good. Holy moly, that is hard. Okay, Stalwart and Doctor, two of like the highest tier defense units. Okay, interesting. So Pilgrim is still good. Because uh, this is like the best item for it, right? So that's cool. I wouldn't mind upgrading a priestess here, but it is missing region inside, which hurts it a lot. It would generate more mana, which means it would be better for curator, but Stalwart was pretty much exactly what I was looking for because this is this becomes a shield to cleave cleanse, which is very, very, very impactful. So I'll have no problems with cleanse for the rest of the game. I think it's, it's got to be worth it. It is a little bit weird. Probably, probably an evoker. Yeah, I, I think evoker will probably appreciate that. And then we can just put the extra healing on it. You go here. Maybe actually, maybe I would like this. I don't know. Nah. Just put on evoker. It's funny. The caltrops gains me mana. That's actually funny. I did not consider that when I took that item. Okay, Let's see what we can do here. Hopefully not lose ninja on turn one again. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
I love that. I would just keep and then please give me shield. Are you kidding me, Stalwart? Are you kidding me? Fucking hey, man. God damn it. That makes me very angry. <sighs> oh man. Actually, it's gonna die 100%, but... There's almost no alternative, because Stalwart breaks. Are you kidding me, man? Any side, any shield side, three rolls, three rolls, any shield side, and we're good. So annoying. Okay, so one, two, drop. Whoops, heal, cleanse. I mean, we're still in a really bad spot, but. I don't know if I can afford to roll, because if I brick here, I mean, there are many sides that are very good here. Including, well, actually not really this, but these three are, I think I have to roll this. I have two rolls for it. I guess that's better than, yeah, that is better. I can go here. Please, Ninja, please, 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 just please roll. Okay. Wait, actually, eh, I mean, if it's that, it's that, whatever. Okay. Guys? Hello? What is happening? How can you not roll three rolls for anything? Anything, any side. You've got to be kidding me. Three rolls any side. What a joke. No way. No way. I have to lock it, right? I probably have to lock that too. I don't know. No, I can't. I can't lock that. I mean, it's kind of useless now. But it did tank. It tanked so much already. So it's, it was already worth it, I think. We just can't... I mean, it will be at one, right? Maybe I do have to roll it, because it's going to be at one anyways. If it rolls cantrip next turn, it's the same thing as it rolling at this turn. At least I have a chance of killing it. Maybe. Well, I wouldn't be able to do it. I don't know. I think it's worth it. I might just sacrifice it and go for the evoker. Okay. Okay, whatever. I think that's worth it. <laughs> I gotta go for the Evoker lethal at this point. There's no way, like this, leaving this at one is probably not a play. I'd rather just do the damage now. I'm so screwed. What oh, fled? Oh, that was an out as well. I forgot. Okay. Okay, Icar Chalice is great. Echo. Icar Chalice is really good because of the synergy. So. Duck. Duck is super good. Duck is super good, but it's also kind of bad because of Caltrops. But yeah, it's kind of. Eh, it, yeah, it's actually kind of bad. Never mind. I'll take Baker and Chalice. It's good against Hexia, too. Alright, now we have a Giga. I could have also. Oh, wait. Why did I not remove left? Okay. Guys, I'm sorry. Um, Again, this is my third run in a row. I did not take a break, so my brain is kind of cooked right now. Uh, sorry about that. That was super obvious. <laughs> yeah, I'm just dumb. Okay, anyways. Um, sorry. I think this is fine, though. The rest is fine. 
to make sure I don't screw up again. The problem is Priestess is, fall it, it, Priestess is falling off right now. It really is. It is 100% falling off. To dodge, I think. I don't think that's better than rolling. It's like, I gotta destroy this crew. Uh, so you're safe. Wait, what is happening here? Carrier. If I can overkill carrier, that would be the best situation, but I don't think I can. I don't know if dodging is actually correct here. It might be. Let me see. So it would be you try to overkill next turn. Shield, shield, heal, because extra healing. What? Oh, wait. That is not Thimble. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. That is not Thimble. Fuck. Okay, whatever. I I might be screwed here. That was a really bad item pick up then, but... I just think we're a little bit too weak. Damage output's not quite there. What am I looking for? Maybe... And I guess this, it's the most reliable way to get rid of that. Oh, I'm so dumb. Now I have a useless ass item on the evoker. I mean, I gotta just gotta just gotta roll for something better. I guess not. Maybe that was fine. No, are you kidding me? just yet but man this ninja has to wake up it's so bad right now it's so bad i can't believe i took that useless ass item oh my god painful please guys okay good good fine no Where's this going? Okay, you can probably save that. Okay, so... I'm pretty sure I can kill that. No? Oh, I can't. Okay, I can't. That was close, though. Wait, maybe I can. I can just go here instead. Oh, that's close. That's so close. That is so close! It's so close. That's unbelievably close. Oh, wait. Oh, it is. Okay. I just miscalculated. Oh, man. I can't believe I took that Icker Chalice. I thought it was Thimble. And I put it on Evoker, too. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I'm playing this so bad. These are the worst possible options, I think. Because I need... I need to replace this. Ah, oh, but I can't. Yeah, this is hard. This is really hard. I don't think I can replace Ninja because it generates mana. I, it might just have to be a Kronos and that's okay, I guess. Random is really scary because my healer is going to be crucial since I have um, Acre Chalice. I got to find somebody that can actually heal a good amount and we're already down two good synergies. So now Forsaken would be kind of bad, and Wraith would be terrible. This sucks. Yeah, Iker Chalice is... Oh, I need to overheal, essentially, to do damage. That sucks. Kronos with... Um, hmm. So Kronos is kind of nice because the cantrip does proc these, and it does help me. The dodge is also cool. It might be good to take Kronos here because, because of the dodge. And we have dodge top and bottom, which is kind of cool. 
It's also pretty good with the... Uh, yeah, it's actually really good with Pocket Phylactery as well. That's a good argument for Kronos. I, the downside, obviously, is that it doesn't have much mana going on, but I don't think any... They all have good bot size, right? Yeah. Wizard. Weaver. Weaver would be good. Ace would be good. Artificer, not so much. Ghast would be good. Repeat. So essentially the only thing this character has going on is repeat. And dodge and reroll. I mean no, all these all four of these sides are good. This will be for the most part impossible to cast. Unless no, I have ninja. Actually it's playable. I think it's worth it. It's good in this fight. Just because it's good in this fight, I think it's good enough. Man, this was a mistake, I think. I don't know. Echo is not that good, to be fair. Actually, it was pretty good. Like on this, maybe. I don't know. It was, it was a mistake, I think, because I would only... Well, it's a, it's a good combo piece if I manage to find the synergy for it, but I'm not obviously not guaranteed to find it. And we already passed Doctor. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was a mistake, 100%. But I didn't... They look the same, right? Kind of. They're both like, well, the other one's like a tr reverse, basically. It's like a, the thimble's the thicker parts on the bottom, like a reverse cup. Anyways. I mean, we're full HP. We got ninja combo still. I think it's fine. Please. Wait, is this inflict death? Oh shit, it is. Maybe I do want the cleanse then. I just feel like I couldn't roll because it's too risky, but... I can't roll. Did both of these characters roll triple cantrip? Self damage? Really? You're not shitting me right now. That actually happened. What the f... Uh... That was not a joke. <laughs> what the? You've got to be kidding me, man. That is ridiculous. Okay, inflict death. I can cleanse that off next turn. These are in very dangerous waters here. I think I have to do this. Oh, yeah. That can happen. Great. Good job. Good job, game. Fantastic. Love that shit. Okay, so can I win this? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, this also copies and flicked death. Wow, I almost lost the game immediately. Okay, cool. Love that. I'm in love with the Coco. So I think I have to re re cleanse. I guess. It's a better play. That is so bad. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if I can win. I, unless I. No, it should be okay. I can. The problem is I need to kill the bones, so the only one that can do that is Ninja. So I have to roll it, and I have to find a cleanse for the death. Okay, if it, I had to roll it. Like, I'm gonna lose the game if I don't do this, so... Wait, you're dead? Are you kidding me? You're actually unironically dead. <laughs> Jesus. Man, I am struggling with this run. I can't believe I rolled the cantrip side immediately. What? Oh, that was at 1 HP. I need to stop playing the game. <laughs> I can't I can't play. I actually can't play. Okay, so I need mana, which means I have to roll this. There's no way I can keep it. I guess you have to stay. I'm gonna lose this. I kind of deserve to lose it, though. I did fuck up big time. Oops. Does that even matter? 
think it does matter that I hit the bones, so... Man, I'm tilted. I'm so tilted. Tilting off the face of this earth. I need Kronos to start growing. Can I win? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I can win. I don't think so. Well, I guess I have a lot of dodge. It's, it's still possible. It just really... I have to roll dodge? Pain? Wait, why are you pained? Oh, no. That's actually really bad. I don't know if I can roll now. I think I can't. I gotta roll... Well, I have to roll for repeat or mana at this point. Because if I roll this and it lands on... The cantrip... It's actually pretty bad. I definitely deserve to I should not have played another run, but I kind of have to. It's fine. Whatever. I, I played this so bad. It's, it's it's very unfortunate. I could have won this run, I think, if I just tightened it up. But, yeah. That's the problem. I'm grinding to get videos ready, but... Uh, it, does, it does trigger me a bit that I played that so bad. Should not have gotten to this point. I mean, repeat doesn't really do much. I just have to go for dodge. And now I'm up to... Now it's just the mercy of the... Now it's just the game. Whether it allows me to win this or not at this point. I have to never roll this ever again. Okay, there's mana, that's good. It's a good turn off. Is this, is this double use or no? It's definitely growth, right? That's the worst target. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, yeah, I forgot if that rolls at once, I'm dead. I mean, I kind of have to keep this, I guess, because the most shield. I'm definitely losing this. I just completely threw the game. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I did get really unlucky in this fight. Uh, we have to admit that. Did, didn't I? Didn't it triple cantrip on turn one? Triple pain cantrip. I mean, it's like both. It was just unfortunate. Everything went wrong, and I also was not in the mindset to to play this correctly. And I had to. I had to navigate this fight perfectly because of how unlucky I was. But yeah, it is what it is. Honestly, you, I'm just. I'm kind of pissed. We were on a good streak too. I'm very angry at myself. But. Too much slice and dice today. Yeah. It's just, I can't believe they just, they immediately roll cantrip. That's what pisses me off. They immediately roll cantrip every time there's a debuff on them or they're one HP. Like that, the fact that my, my, um, my prophet, wait, what is it? Not prophet, uh, priestess immediately died on 1 HP is so tilting to me. Same thing with the death cantrip. I could have rolled for the cleanse on turn one to cleanse that. I just forgot that the cantrip could just immediately kill my unit and it did. <sighs> Same thing with the fucking... Oh, whatever. Probably should not have equipped Phylactic in this fight because I just forgot about the pain synergy as well. What I guess the only out I have is that somehow this rolls only 
slate for the rest of the game, and I roll dodge every time it targets me. What the hell is happening? I hate when it does this because it's like, yeah, there's a 99.9% .9 chance you're gonna lose, but. But. GG. Not a good game, but... Oh man, if RNG was just a little bit nicer, I would have probably gone through that fight, because I was... Yeah. I didn't have the right... focus to get through that. It was a little bit too hard. All I had to do was, like, use two mana, shield this so it's at three instead of one... Rolled for the cleanse turn one because I can just die, and it did. And then th those two things would have changed the, the fight into a guaranteed win, pretty much. And maybe not equipping Phylactery. Yeah, probably not equipping this. So three, like, pretty big mistakes. Also, picking this was a mistake. It was just, oh man, it was so bad. Oh, what a terrible run. That's pretty depressing. Oh, to end the day on that too, man. Oof. Yeah, the game the game is not that easy <laughs> that I can just do that, but Well. Thanks for watching. Yeah, I don't care as much about the streak now, so that's something. If I would well. I guess if I really cared about the streak, I would not be playing this way in the first place, so... I'm at least somewhat thankful that I don't... I'm not gonna go into, like... It's not gonna ruin my day, necessarily, that I lost this. It would've... In the past, when I, when I was actually trying to win streak record... I would've been demolished for the rest of the day, so... But I would not be playing that way, so it's kind of like... It's an impossible situation for the most part. Because I would not be playing as fast. Or I wouldn't I wouldn't even play this run in the first place, because I would wait to be a little bit more focused, but either way, again, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Despite my not great gameplay and me complaining a lot, but uh, <laughs> it is what it is. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.